This is a demonstration of how to build a simple Order of Battle file, an OOB file. I've already opened the Order of Battle editor. This is for Squad Battles of Vietnam. And when you open it, this is the first thing you get, a dialog box that allows you to select one of the existing Orders of Battle. We're going to go ahead and we're going to cancel this request and build our own. Now, as I've mentioned before, due to the limitations of the YouTube capture window and the ability to display good resolution imagery, our window is going to be rather zoomed in, so I'm going to have to drag the, drag the capture window back and forth a bit so that you'll be able to see everything. So I hope everyone will bear with us with that limitation. So we've canceled the selecting a file dialog, and now we're going to start all new first thing to do is to select the top-level organizations for each side. To do this, we highlight Order of Battle, the top line in the window. We right-click and say Add. I have a dialog box at this point, and the box here allows me to select the nation, and we'll select American. That's essentially not just the nation, but also the side that to be played. For the category of unit, it's important to pick a unit which, if you decide to build the AI for a scenario, that is high enough that it can capture the commands for uh, an organization, not just a side. So I try to, and when I build a scenario, I prefer to go to have my top level organization no lower than a company, and that's what I'll do here. And we'll call it Bravo Company. and we've added a name and we'll click OK. Now as you can see Bravo Company is here on there on the display. Now we'll go back and click the order of battle again right click again, click add and we'll add the enemy side. In this case we'll pick North Vietnamese drag over and again we'll pick company. And I'll add a name I just made up called Bin Tho. I have no idea what that means. And I'll build a company, CY, an abbreviation used sometime for company. So that's it. I've now created the two sides for the scenario. And each side now is a company, so you can add units below that. And we'll go ahead and end this, and this will be the first part of the scenario of the order battle builder and then next one will show you how to flesh out the order of battle.